This past year, NOAA had two main goals. One was to be Rolex Junior Player of the Year, and the second was to be named to the Junior Ryder Cup team. Player of the Year, I felt, was more of an out there goal because of just how strong the 2017 class is. When I heard early on that it was down to you know two or three kids that they were gonna pick from, my question was, how can it not be him? I mean, what a tremendous accolade that um, a youth player developing their skills with aspirations of play at the, the highest level can receive. Uh, my reactions as a coach is just immense pride and like uh, overwhelming emotion. Those are the things that make my heart sing. Nothing surprised me about him at all anymore. And it's something that he deserves. I mean, he's put a lot of time and effort into it. He's a really solid driver and he's really good inside five feet. I haven't seen him miss a putt inside five feet the whole time we've been playing together. And I think that's what sets him apart from other junior golfers. It was well deserved that he was player of the year this year. Noah was introduced to the game of golf by just wanting to go to the golf course with me, hang out with dad time. He taught me the game and I began to grow a love and a passion for it. Not having ever met him, I was down at the range and I looked down and I see this father kind of sitting Indian style on the range behind his son who was not much taller than the bag stand that was uh, beside him. I tried teaching him at first. That worked for a while until he stopped listening and we had to hire professional help. It began with short game and it progressed into uh, all facets of the game, both those that you can see as you watch a player compete and just as importantly, those that you can't see. And really the difference makers to take a player from good, which he was when we first started, to world class, which is where he is right now. Noah started playing the North Texas events, but he always wanted to play AJGA. When I would ask him about it, he'd be like, no, that's my goal for next year. When Noah was 12, he started playing AJGA qualifiers, a junior all-star tournament, and one open tournament. And four years later, he is Rolex Junior Player of the Year. And when you set lofty goals, and you want to fulfill those goals, it also holds you accountable, making sure you do what it takes to help achieve those goals. Every December, I just sit down with my dad and I, we assess what I did and how much I can improve, and we set goals from there. At the USAM last year, uh, it was the first big tournament that I caddied for him. On the 21st hole, you know, he was the 62nd seed. We got in in a playoff, and so we knew we had to make this putt to keep going, and it caught the front lip and lipped out on the low side. It devastated him. When we got back this year, his motivation was that one putt. It's the little things like that that make him so determined to get to his goal. The thing that's made the biggest improvement in my game over the past year has definitely been my mental game. Two years ago, I was always pretty down on myself. I wasn't really competing the way I wanted to in golf tournaments. So I would say at the beginning of this year, I finally just allowed myself to realize that everything's just gonna come in time. And that really just took a burden off my shoulders and just allowed me to play golf the way I knew I could. The thing that sets Noah apart from other youth players, his age is his maturity. The recognition that I, I can put in the work physically, but yet if I don't see myself as a champion before I start and see myself as a champion when I am finish the round, whether I win the tournament or not, then I'm probably making the job harder on myself from a long-term standpoint of continuing to climb. So I think he's beyond his years for a 16-year-old. You may think number one's being it, He's not done, <laughs> so his goals are higher than that. Nothing's going to stop him. He has the ability to be the best out there. I see him becoming a mentor to others. I see a, a great place for him to continue to perform well and opportunity for him to give back, and I'm sure he'll do that in spades. There's so many great names that are associated with this award. It just gives me more hope that I'll be able to achieve the things that I dream to one day.